the school of environmental sciences practices innovative field based teaching the students and faculty go to various ecosystem like forest wetlands coastal areas disaster regions etc to practice the field based learning hands on training of 2 to 3 weeks duration on instrumentation is being given to pg students for better understanding of various sensitive analytical instruments like icpms gcms lcms lcqtof ftir mercury analyzer etc arctic expedition is being continued with the mou between mahatma gandhi university and national center for polar and ocean research goa and it created a number of new opportunities in teaching and research during 2017-2018 one faculty member and three students were engaged in arctic expedition to explore the polar environment arctic expedition has improved enormously the teaching and research prospects of the school for the first time in the history of affiliating universities in the country a full length feature film samaksham has been produced under the banner Mahatma Gandhi University Creations to project the necessity for organic way of living and organic farming among the student community, academics and the general public. This venture re-establishes the lost connect of the people with the soil, agriculture and ecosystem, avoiding artificial and chemical means and reiterates its essentiality in leading a simple, healthy, happy and hygienic life in tune with the ideals of the father of the nation. Jaivam Project, a unique organic literacy drive, is to spread the message of organic farming and organic means of living in all the 71 Gramma Panjayats and six municipalities of the district of Kottim and through model subsequent campaigns in six Panjayats and one municipality in different districts of the state. School of Behavioral Sciences is a unique interdisciplinary university department in India which was established with the purpose of promotion of mental health and prevention of disabilities at primary, secondary and tertiary levels. Field visits to special schools, rehabilitation centers, palliative care centers, institutions and agencies working among the marginalized people are organized to learn from real life situations, flash mobs, Exhibitions, poster, collage and debate competitions are organized on relevant themes to facilitate critical thinking and active learning. The academic and research activities are organized at community level to extend services to the community and to make the program meaningful. The Vocational Rehabilitation Center, Inter University Center for Disability Studies, Institute of Research in Learning Disabilities and Santvanam Counseling Center, which are functioning in the department, facilitate comprehensive learning through multiple learning experiences. Patents The faculty members of Mahatma Gandhi University had proved to be front runners in the development of indigenous technologies, bringing numerous laurels to the institution. Patents are one among them. The International and Inter-University Center for Nanoscience and Nanotechnology at Mahatma Gandhi University is very much committed to translate their research findings to useful products. In this context, we have filed recent patents based on polymer nanocomposites for EMI shielding applications. Mr. Avinash has uh, uh, developed uh, the silicon-based uh, polymer nanocomposites uh, for EMI shielding applications. Now, without the shielder, you can see that the LED is uh, glowing because the circuit is complete and current is flowing. And once you keep this shielder on the top of this uh, mobile phone, you can see that there is no current flowing through this because there is no signal coming out of the guard gate. This is the bioprocess lab of School of Biosciences, Mahatma Gandhi University. Uh, we are usually involved in designing of the bioprocess and bioreactors. You now, the bioreactor for which the patent has been patent number has been awarded uh, is being designed by us. Uh, this is actually a technical support given to uh, Dr. Sabu A of Department of Microbiology and Biotechnology, Kannur University. This is a DBT, Department of Biotechnology sponsored project. We have designed that reactor. We have. Uh, we are being given the patent number 
and that reactor is now being utilized by farmers uh, under the leadership of MS Swaminathan Foundation. This is being utilized for the processing of coffee husk and specifically this whole coffee husk is utilized through solid state fermentation for the production of biopesticides. Value added conversion of prawn shell waste materials and in this study the prawn shell waste materials collected from prawn shell industry were subjected to particular process and converted into materials and these materials were used for plant disease resistance property and the results are shown here. This is about the plants which were subjected to pathogen attack. These were the plants which were subjected to uh, treatment with the material and then pathogen attack and this is a control plan and here we can see that the material applied plants were protected from uh, further damage due to the presence of this material and the same has been submitted for patent. Enhancing the paper in production by the fungi isolated from Piper nigrum. Piper nigrum the plant is well known for paper in production and in our study we could isolate endophytic fungi from the plant and this was found to have the ability to produce paper in. And by an innovative approach, we used different type of substrates for the fermentative production of piperin. And in our study, substrates with the nanoscale range substrate was found to enhance the piperin production. The Business Innovation and Incubation Center supports innovations, incubations, entrepreneurship by extending administrative, academic and financial support to students through R&D support, startup grants, patent facilitation and entrepreneurship support. The center has struck the 100 startup mark, thus raising Mahatma Gandhi University to the rank of the first university in the state to own this distinction. In a short span of two years, 14 patent applications have been filed through the center.